Hey Twin Flames, this is an energy forecast for the week ahead. So let's see what's up with your Twin Flame with you. And finally, what next steps you can take to speed up your harmonious Twin Flame union. This is a general reading, but I'm also offering personal Twin Flame readings and healing sessions. I have all the info under the video. So let's get started with your Twin Flame. Let's see what they'll be up to this week, what energies are going to come up. And we have Inner Temple. So I'm sensing that your Twin Flame will be going through a massive spiritual awakening this week. They're connecting deeper with their inner self, they're showing up for themselves, and they're developing a true relationship with their soul. This is going to make them receive better, more accurate guidance on what their next steps are with you. I get the feeling that for some of you, your twin flame hasn't been connecting with their feelings, which is causing issues in your relationship. And this is going to start changing this week. So rest assured, it's going to be okay. This week, your twin flame is also going deeper into their devotion for you and this journey. The twin flame journey requires so much commitment and I know that this is an area that plenty of you are struggling with in your unions. So this card is confirmation that slowly but surely this energy of non-commitment is leaving. The more you do your part, committing to yourself and your healing process, your twin flame meets you halfway, even if you don't see it yet. You're called to trust and have faith as your twin flame undergoes this massive spiritual awakening, which... There's going to be some upheaval at first, but it's ultimately going to lead to a closer and more secure relationship between the two of you. Next up, let's see what's up with you this week. What's going to come up? And we have Warrior Woman. All right. So there's something you really need to do in order to move forward. You know what that is. But you've been afraid and delaying it because of that. Maybe it's a serious conversation you need to have. Maybe a boundary needs to be asserted. Maybe you need to make this lifestyle change, such as switching jobs, prioritizing your physical health. What you're going through right now requires a lot of courage, and the only one standing in your way right now is yourself and your fears, really. This card reminds you that whatever it is that you're scared of, it isn't that big of a deal after all, because you're divinely protected. You don't need to worry or lose sleep over it. Just go ahead and do it. Be brave. Remember that the more resistance you have to answering a call, the more important that call is for your soul's growth. Facing bigger challenges is a sign that the divine trusts you to handle more things than you used to. So it's a sign that you're on the right track and you're awakening. And now is the next level. And the next level comes with its own set of challenges. So this week, you'll be called to release all the fear and do what you need to do to move forward. And you can trust that the rewards will be far more beautiful than you ever imagined. So don't let your fears hold you back and do whatever it is that you need to do. And finally, let's see your next steps. What is it that you can do in order to speed up your harmonious twin flame union? And we have Leap. You go first, the universe will catch you. This is funny. So we just spoke about courage and letting go of fears, and that requires trust. If you don't trust the universe to catch you, you're going to be afraid when you leap, right? So this card is yet more confirmation that you need to take that risk. You need to make this move. If you don't know what this risk or move is yet, then you can take some time after this video to meditate and... Ask the divine in your heart, what is it that I need to do next? And whatever comes up, no matter how crazy, give yourself some space to listen to it. The universe wants to support you and it's going to support you. Because when you're on a twin flame journey, you're aligning with your highest potential and you're fulfilling your highest soul's mission. So of course the universe is going to support that. It's perfectly aligned with divine love. It's also normal to feel anxious or afraid when you're doing something that's completely new. But you don't need to let those feelings control you or stop you from living your fullest potential. 
This card is a message to you that these fears are illusions and they're only holding you back. And if you didn't have this fear holding you back, then you'd be completely free. So it's safe to completely release it. So try this new approach. If the old one hasn't been working so far, make the bold move. The only way you can move forward on your twin flame journey is through facing your fears and making it to the other side. And Spirit wants you to know that you have so much spiritual support available to you right now. Your angels, your spirit guides, they're always there for you, working behind the scenes, and they're cheering you on. They want to see you victorious. So don't be afraid to take risks this week and be emotionally present with yourself as you do. Because you're going to need that when you move through those fears. So this is all I had for you for the week ahead, my dear Twin Flames. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in next week's video.